and welcome. Today I'm going to share with you all a recipe that I recently had when I flew on an Emirates flight to Dubai and it's basically similar to Trinidad Dal just this doesn't have jeera and it's not chunked. and for this recipe I have here one small packet of spinach and um, this is the spinach that I'm talking about that you use to make salad if you want to use um, dashing bush ba baji for this you can use that also I also have one cup of dal that I washed some turmeric, you need some salt, some chili peppers or hot peppers, pimento peppers, whatever you want to put to flavor this, some chopped garlic and chopped onion. I will leave the correct list of ingredients and measurements down below in the description box for you all. So let's get started on putting this dish together. You want to start by putting up a pot with some water on medium heat and to this pot we're going to add the dal. onions, garlic, pepper, you can add as much or as little pepper as you want, turmeric, and salt to taste, and we are, going, we are going to allow this to come up to a boil and allow that dal to soften. When your dal grains are soft, take your hand blender and you're going to blend this until it's smooth. So, you see the consistency of the dal? You don't want it to be too thick because when you add the spinach, it's going to thicken up some more. So at this point, you want to add your spinach and it's just going to wilt down in here. And this is a great vegetarian alternative if you like. Because you can just serve this with some rice and maybe some anchar pepper that I have on my channel that would taste really good with this. So just allow this to melt down in here. Once that has happened then we'll taste it for salt because spinach leaves they won't take long to cook because they are very tender. So my dal with spinach is finished. And I went ahead and I tasted it for salt and it has just enough salt for me. So make sure you want to taste your food before you take it down. So I'm going to take this off and I'm going to dish it out and show you what it looks like. So here you have it, my dal with spinach recipe. So I hope you guys try it and let me know what you think if you all like it also. And if you make it, send me photos. Um, thank you all for joining me in the kitchen today and I will see you all another day with another one of my recipes. Enjoy!